1967 in the United Kingdom, the Twix Bar was born, and back then it was called Raider. Today we're going to try three different types of Twix ice cream bars. There's the Twix original ice cream bar, as I mentioned, was used to be named Raider. There's the Twix cookies and cream ice cream bar. And then there's the Twix triple chocolate ice cream bar. And you'll notice the label right here, we've got two right Twix and one left Twix. It's a total marketing gimmick, um, the left and the right Twix thing. So in theory, there should be six of these if I wanted a, a left, two lefts of these and a right of these, but this will have to do for today's video. So we're gonna try each of these. I'll tell you which one's the best. And before I open it, I'm gonna make my guess. I have no idea which one's the best. This chocolate one says it's a rich, creamy chocolate ice cream with smooth caramel and crunchy chocolate cookies surrounded by a delicious chocolatey coating. So this has chocolate ice cream chocolate coating. The Twix cookies and cream is vanilla ice cream mixed with chocolate cookie pieces topped with crunchy chocolate cookies. And the original is rich and creamy vanilla flavored ice cream with artificial flavor added and smooth caramel and crunchy cookies. I'm a little surprised they're kind of touting the artificial thing there. But hey, whatever helps them sell more Twix bars, right? Um, so let's open these up. I'm going to slice them in half before we eat them just so you can get a feel for what the inside looks like. Twix is the original cookie crunch, um, and I was just reading on Wikipedia. Now I'll, I'll keep the wrapper there so you know which one's which. That's the left Twix original. We got the cookies and cream. These were brought to the United States in 1979. So just shortly after I was born, another invention came into the world, the Twix cookies and cream. And then here's the Twix triple chocolate. Okay, that one's falling apart a little bit. Okay, okay. So they look pretty much the same from the outside. You can see caramel coming out of there. See if I spin them around, I'm confusing you. You don't know which one's which. Let's see if we can even tell. All right, so we're gonna take this big purple knife, just give it a nice slice right down there. So let's take a look at the inside. That's the original Twix, the cookies and cream, and the triple chocolate. Ooh, that one's got caramel and little chocolate chunks. So let's start by taking a bite of the original. Mmm. Ah, it has that cookie crunch. There's little balls of cookie in there. That must be what those little things are. Yeah, it's a little crunchy cookie ball. Kind of looks like a peanut, like you're used to eating a Snickers and you think it's a peanut. Mmm. That's good. It's awesome. The Mars company invented this one. All right, let's go for the cookie and cream version. Mm. All right, it's pretty close tasting to the other one. Just got a subtle different flavor with that cookie and cream ice cream. Still has the caramel. Chocolate tastes the same. Mm. The cookie ball is a, see those little balls right there? Cookie balls. All right, now we're gonna go for the triple chocolate. This one's falling apart on me. The little cookie balls are the same as the ones in the cookies and cream. All right, so let's take a bite of that one. Mm. It's a good chocolate ice cream. I mean, the Mars Company, I read the book the emperors of chocolate, Forrest Mars, he was obsessant over quality. He had to have the little chocolate swirl just right. Mm. This one's a little overbearing from my perspective. I think the original has the nice compliment of the vanilla, artificial vanilla, as they like to say on the package. Mmm. And then this is kind of the middle ground. If you look at the three of these side by side, it's really like you got the vanilla, the chocolate, and then you fuse the two like that, and it kind of makes the one in the, in the middle. So on a, a score, 
I'm just pretending like I have to keep tasting these to give you a score, but I already know what they taste like. I'm just enjoying myself here. Um, I'm gonna go with the original as the best. I just like the contrast between the vanilla, artificial vanilla, as they say, and uh, probably go with the cookies and cream second best. And then the chocolate here, this one's number three. Obviously it's not that bad if I'm just popping the rest in my mouth, so they're all good. Let's just look at the nutrition facts real quick. So I'm going best, the original, cookies and cream, second best, and then chocolate, third. So 250 calories, the chocolate one. This one has 250 calories, 250 calories. Wow, almost the same, 23 grams of sugar. This one here has 23 grams of sugar and this has 23 grams of sugar. How did they do that? They're like, let's put the exact same ingredients on all of them. Now 15 grams of fat, 14 grams there, and 15 grams. So if you're going for the lower fat option by one gram, get the cookies and cream. But if you're going for a low fat snack, probably want to avoid this whole section in general. It's not really like a diet thing here. So. I'm kind of regretting that I actually did eat a donut before this, so I was not hungry for something sweet and indulgent. Um, but that actually makes this review better, because when you're super hungry, you think everything tastes better. But I still think this original Twix ice cream bar is good, and I'm not even hungry. So this is Mark from Ice Cream Meltdown. Thanks for joining. The, the original Twix is the best. I only tried the left Twix tonight, so I can't give you an opinion on the right Twix. That might be totally different, some other thing. Who knows? So, but you can also find the right Twix uh, at your local grocery store. So thanks for joining. Please subscribe if you haven't already, and uh, we'll see you next time.